Some of you might know this, that a book and a made-for-television movie was made on that book trying to envision what had really happened. But it was false, of course. It's not true. The truth is, uh, many of you are know, know this. What happened after the movie? First of all, you need to know that the characters in that classic novel were based on real people. Rhett Butler, real name is Rhett Turnipseed. And Scarlett O'Hara, real name is Emlyn Louise Hannon. Uh, in real life, Rhett really walked out on her and he joined the Confederate Army. What happened after that, after the war, is one of the great story of the amazing grace of God. After the end of the Civil War, Rhett turned up seed, gambled, and drifted around the country, and he ended up in Nashville, Tennessee. And there in Nashville in 1871, he was completely transformed by the power of the grace of God. On Easter Sunday morning, 1871, Rhett repented and received Jesus as his Savior. Not only that, but he went to seminary, and there he enrolled, and he graduated and became a Methodist preacher. And back then, uh, the Methodist preachers used to have circuit. They called them circuit riders. And uh, he, would, he had a whole circuit of churches that he was riding around rural Kentucky. But that's not all. Red and Scarlet, Emlyn, crossed paths again, not deliberately, but this is how it happened. A young woman in one of Red's congregations ran away from home, and Red became very concerned as her pastor especially when he heard rumors that she was working in a house of prostitution in St. Louis. So he personally went to look for her and try to track her down in order to bring her back home. Finally, he tracked the young lady down, but he was told that the madam of the house would never let her go. So when Rhett asked to speak to the madam, imagine his utter amazement to find out that the madam is no other than Emlyn. And so he immediately challenged her to a game of cards. But he made a stipulation. He said, if I win the game, you have to let the young woman go free. And winning he did with a royal flush. And so, the girl who was let go, was set free, was married, and became a matriarch of a leading family. 